Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Aries. Welcome back, my love. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Aries. You've been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful, sexy-ass temple of yours, Aries, as it takes care of you, my loves. Welcome back. Come on in. Have a seat, loves. Get comfortable. Shout out to the evolving spirits. Shout out to the soul tribe members, gang, gang. I appreciate you all as well for your continuous love and support. I thank you all so much. And welcome back to the Patreon family, gang, gang. It's an honor and a pleasure to assist you all. I definitely hope you all have been enjoying the content here just as much as I have. And welcome to the ones that are new here. It is an honor and a pleasure to have you. Definitely if the reading here resonates with your spirit, we would love to have you here part of family as well. Definitely don't forget to like, subscribe, and adjust your notification bell. So that way you are aware for when I go live here on this platform as well for all Zodiac sign readings, Aries, all right? This week, we have been focusing in on the color yellow. Yes, we've been focusing in on our sacra and our solar plexus chakra this week, right? We have definitely been tapping into our creative part of ourselves. Yellow always reminds me of positivity, uh, fresh new starts, right? I love working with the color yellow. So definitely if that's something that you're interested in, keep up with the community tab. That is where I post new colors that we transition into each week and also ways to how to manifest with colors as well. If you would love to learn how to manifest with colors, Join our Soul Tribe and Patreon family where I can go more into details with you and get you on the right track, loves, all right? So let's dive into your love life, Aries. Let's see what's coming towards you for love in 2023. Ooh, wow. The Ace of Pentacles here. Wow. Hmm. Let's bring it back. Bring it back. All right, I wanted to mention the Ace of Cups here, okay, is why I was so wowed here. But I heard Channel Out, Aries, the page, ooh, slow down, spirit, okay? We don't went from the Ace of Pentacles to the Ace of Cups here in my hand, and now the Page of Pentacles. So you got some communication that's coming in here, Aries. Again, this could be from a water sign here, a Cancer, a Pisces, or a Scorpio here. Ooh, and also a Temperance. This is Archer energy here. A Sagittarius here for other of you all. All right. So this is something that now it's taking place here for you, Aries, because now things are mentally, physically, and emotionally here are balancing out for you. You have a new beginning of love coming towards you here. Okay. You have an offer here. Again, this could be coming from a water sign or a fire sign here, a Sagittarius or a Scorpio, a Cancer or a Pisces here. Okay. Whoever this particular person here is that is on your mind here, they've thought about this for quite some time here now. I thought this person has been trying to wait for the perfect moment here. Yes, we got the seven of wands here. Here's your energy here as well. This is fire element here. Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius energy here as well, all right? So whoever this person here is, Aries, they've had to fight, okay? They had to basically defend themselves from people, places, and situations that no longer resonate for them. So because because they are choosing here to want to go about this brand new beginning of love energy here with you okay other people unfortunately do not like that don't don't like excuse me the choice that your person here aries is deciding to make okay so they feel like they have their opinion about this this could be some outside influence here on this relationship or this connection that you have with this particular person here this could also be family members around you okay or mutual friends here all right there's definitely some energies here with the seven of ones here that are not happy about this union here or this relationship here that is coming together for you okay yeah we got the ten of ones here because your person here was went through some burdens here through these obstacles and challenges here with people from their past okay this could be a lot of burdens put on your person here through family through an ex here okay through work all right but this is something that your person had decided to put the burdens down here they're no longer going up this hill with all these different broomsticks in their hand from other people issues problems and situations they rather carry their on and defend themselves and this is what they're doing so i feel like your person is now standing up for this relationship they're standing up for you four 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 and o'clock as i said that yes this relationship is being spiritually protected and guided all at the same time all right you are being protected by your ancestors here aries and so is this particular person here because this is like a 
innocent, good energy here. I'm not going to say we're not innocent, right? None of us is perfect Aries, but I want to say because of the type of person you are or this person here is, they are being spiritually protected through their guardian angels and ancestors here from these particular energies and people that they had to deal here with in the past is why I just seen 444 on the clock, okay? So that is very significant here. Yeah, we have the Six of Swords here, okay? Some of y'all, this could be an air sign here or your ex here could be an air sign here. We have Aquarius, Libra, and also Gemini energy here this call talks about removing yourself again from people that cause you or your person here aries a lot of pain a lot of trauma a lot of hurt okay a lot of disappointment here regarding people and situations where they made choices here to affect you or your person's life here and begin to put a lot of burdens on this relationship here i feel like you and this particular person here just wants to be happy but unfortunately there are other people that are trying to intervene in this relationship Yes, the world car. Because people know that this person or whoever your person was with here in the past, Aries, is done. You might as well put a fucking fork in it, okay? And some people have a hard time accepting this. This could be the ex here that has a hard time accepting that this relationship here with your person is over, okay? Or even your ex here, Aries, is having a hard time trying to close out this cycle with you, even though the universe has already initiated initiate that this relationship or this cycle has been closed out you've passed the test here when it comes to this particular person here you've learned what you needed to learn from this experience in this relationship with this particular person here you now have confidence in yourself this person does you also here know how to now set these happy boundaries for yourself to not let people places and situations come in and disturb your peace here and this is what's causing i feel like a lot of chaos or drama around you and you don't even have to be involved in this mess but this is just how people are feeling about you but not telling you okay because of course they don't want to make themselves look like a fucking idiot here so they rather not say anything yeah they don't make me feel like you so we're going to dive deeper here i'm going to use my raw tarot deck here that i created for you all and again if the reading here so far is resonating with your spirit and your higher selves don't forget to like subscribe and definitely adjust your notification bell so you can be ready for the next wake and tarot as well my loves all right yeah look at this it's all lies okay so this particular person here they lied about this okay this particular person that's trying to intervene with this relationship they could have lied to your person here or your ex here could have lied to you about this other person here that they knew that you were getting into a relationship here with or at least had entrance here and so basically someone here is trying to cock block this particular relationship here yeah look at that damn i want you yeah your person wants to be with you they think about you they definitely imagine you two being together but there is someone here that's really trying to intervene because they're not getting the attention from this person here or you're not giving the attention here from this particular person here yes this hurts my soul so it's starting to particular affect this person here consciously here and spiritually because this is something that they know they were wrong and that they know that they caused in the first place here yeah look at that i'm waiting outside so some of y'all this particular person here is waiting outside this could be someone that's trying to pop up again trying to do a lot of inconvenient here situations to try to cause drama here when all in all i thought this person has tried to gaslight you aries or your person here because they realize that this cycle is over with it's nothing else i feel like that this particular person here could do to cause this relationship to not move forward yes i was wrong sorry so even this person here is trying to admit they're wrong or trying to confess at this time here because they know that they're losing you or losing your person here at this time here okay yeah look at that you got what i want so it's like this person person is finally now through all this situation or circumstance they're now recognizing who the one for you or this person was all this time and all this stuff that maybe a veil was over their eye maybe they were just blindsided to the fact that this person was manipulating your person here aries and now that the truth has came out this particular person don't have anything to show for it, so they're trying to cause conflicts with this relationship that you are occurring or having with this particular person yes i can't make this up aries we have i'm going to tell the truth okay so this particular person here 
this could also be a misunderstanding. This could have been a situation where the person, again, that lied or your ex or your person's ex lied about the situation. They could have probably tried to reach out to you. And now your person is trying to come in and tell the truth on what really happened between this other person here that is an outside influence and don't want you two to be in a relationship here together. Okay. Wow. Powerful reading here, Aries. Definitely, again, if the reading here has resonated for your spirit and your higher selves, loves, don't forget to like, subscribe, adjust your notification bell so you can be ready for when I go live here on the platform. I do go live Aries throughout the week for all zodiac sign readings. I am also available for personal readings. If you would love to get extended reading here and dive more into this reading here and get an understanding of what needs to be done next or what needs to take place here, I would love to assist you. My email is down below in the description box for personal readings. And if you would love to extend your stay here and join our Patreon soul family, we would love to have you. All right, we definitely do go more into oracle messages there i do provide and also daily content on ways to spiritually mentally and emotionally evolve you also get free questions each and every time i go live for all patreon members and you get all the content i post here on youtube first all right so definitely if that's something that you're interested in as well we would love to have you a part of our patreon soul family and thank you all aries for your comments i see you i hear you thank you for your feedback i appreciate you all and remember aries Aries, your health is your wealth. Bye-bye.